The world first met Gia Judice when she was eight years old on Bravo's hit reality TV show, Real Housewives of New Jersey, alongside her parents, Teresa and Joe Judice. Today, she's all grown up and pursuing her own dreams, all while dealing with the realities of both her parents doing time in prison. Like many young starlets these days, Gia has monetized her Instagram presence by advertising various products to her hundreds of thousands of followers. As one of her many endorsements, Gia agreed to promote a meal replacement called 310 Shake in a now-deleted post from 2017, a move that left many criticizing the teen, her mother, and the brand. According to the International Business Times, comments began pouring in with one user asking, What kind of examples are you setting for other girls your age? Body image is such a big issue with young girls and you shouldn't promote it. Weight loss drinks are full of sugar and most of them are genetically engineered. Death, not healthy. Meanwhile, others defended the 16-year-old with one fan pointing out, I don't think she's promoting a weight loss shake. She's into cheerleading and gymnastics. I'm pretty sure it's just about staying healthy. Gia, don't let people make you feel bad. You're a strong young lady. Keep it up. If there's one thing Teresa Judice loves, it's makeup. After all, she revealed to Glamour in 2018 that her go-to beauty routine cost a whopping $22,077 per year. In August 2019, Gia made her mama extra proud when she landed a modeling contract for Stila Cosmetics. Teresa shared a number of behind-the-scenes videos on her Instagram stories, and Gia looked stunning in nude tones, including a shimmery pink eye and extra glossy lip. The gig sent Teresa down memory lane. She told her Instagram followers that it reminded her of the days when she'd take a younger Gia on auditions. She may be daddy's little girl forever, but Gia's no longer a little girl by any means. In May 2019, she took to Instagram to make an exciting announcement and prove she was all grown up. Wearing a Rutgers University t-shirt, she wrote, It's official. Are you 2023? Fast forward a few months and mom was dropping her eldest daughter off at university for her very first semester. Of course, the Real Housewives of New Jersey star documented the momentous day on her Instagram stories. According to People, Teresa started off with footage of Gia packing up her things, then saying a tearful goodbye to her dog, Bella, before eventually arriving at her dorm room in New Jersey. Gia's uncle, her grandfather, and her youngest sister were all on hand for the big day. As mom Teresa previously told Bravo TV, Gia plans to pursue a degree in law. Teresa faced backlash from her followers when she reposted a video showing Gia and her cousin celebrating their college admission by popping bottles. The reality TV star meant for the post to be celebratory, writing, Congratulations to my beautiful daughter and niece on their new chapter in life. I'm so excited for both of you to follow your dreams and take what life has to offer you. However, it soon turned into a magnet for criticism. One critic commented, Great example letting minors pop bottles of alcohol. Parent of the year right there. Another wrote, Wow, really? How about something more appropriate for two little girls? Meanwhile, yet another argued, I understand the pride and happiness to celebrate, but it could have been left out of your post. Young girls seeing this will think it's the cool kid thing to do. Just simple common sense. While the Judais family was expecting to be reunited with Patriarch Joe following the completion of his 41-month prison sentence, they were dealt a serious blow in October 2018. According to Page Six, Pennsylvania's York Immigration Court ruled that he should be deported back to his native Italy upon release from jail, leaving Gia and her siblings dealing with the unthinkable. He's remained in ICE custody and has reportedly not seen his wife and kids since his release from prison. If Joe gets deported, he'll never be able to go to her graduation, celebrate their birthdays, anything. He's going to be missing out on so much. As the probability of Gia losing her father grows, she's tried to remain strong. In May 2019, she took to Instagram to wish him a happy birthday, writing, Happy birthday to the guy who teaches me every day to keep going and never stop fighting. You inspire me every day. Love you so much. Keep smiling. See you soon. Not only has Gia had to witness both of her parents spend time behind bars, but she's also been forced to grow up fast and become an anchor for her mother. In September 2019, a source cited by Hollywood Life claimed, It was a difficult transitional period with Joe away, but now that Gia has also moved out, Teresa isn't sure what life will be like for her. Here's hoping it all works out for them. Check out one of our newest videos right here. Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.